नेक्स्ट वन इज पैराबोला ओके एसेंट्रिसिटी मेथड और जनरल मेथड जनरल मेथड सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन ऑफ पैराबोला ड्रॉ ए पैराबोला विथ द डिस्टेंस ऑफ द फोकस फ्रॉम द डायरेक्ट्रिक्स एट फिफ्टी एम एम ओके ऑल्सो ड्रॉ ए टेंजेंट एंड नॉर्मल टू द पैराबोला एट ए पॉइंट सिक्सटी एम एम फ्रॉम द डायरेक्ट्रिक्स ओके प्लीज ड्रॉ द पैराबोला बाई यूजिंग एसेंट्रिसिटी मेथड और जनरल मेथड सी द प्रोसीजर हाउ टू ड्रॉ ए पैराबोला ओके सी चूज अ लाइन कमैंड लाइन कमैंड नो आई एम चेंजिंग कलर ऑफ द लेयर ओके ड्रॉ वन वर्टिकल लाइन ड्रॉ वन वर्टिकल लाइन दिस लाइन इज नाउन एज डायरेक्टरिंग लाइन draw one parallel axis parallel axis like this okay so give the text give the text so this is the a point this one is b point then this is the point is c okay then this point is d ab is the directrix line so cd is the parallel axis okay then mark focus point mark focus point on cd line on cd line okay see here the distance from the focus to directrix is 50 focus to directrix is 50 see this is the directrix line okay so please mark focus point but how to mark the focus point by using offset command see here choose offset specify first point then now i am taking 50 okay choose this vertical line like this okay so this is the vertex point text enter okay and see this is the focus point clear repeat the text okay so this one is the focus point next one is after uh, marking the focus point you need to mark the vertex point also vertex point also in parabola in parabola so please uh, divide the two parts okay so please divide the two parts two equal parts on cf line okay so please divide the cf line into two equal parts okay so why we are taking uh, so two equal parts so we know that uh, for eccentricity for a parabola is 1 okay see here e equal to now i am taking 1 so in denominator also 1 see here so please add numerator and denominator 1 plus 1 equal to 2 1 plus 1 equal to 2 okay so one means the distance between focus to sorry focus to vertex then so remaining one is remaining one is vertex to or directrix so that so please divide cf line into two equal parts okay by using offset command see now i am choosing the offset offset okay the distance is from a cf line the length of cf line is 50 okay So fifty by two, how much? Twenty-five. So please type twenty-five. Select this one. Select this one like this. Okay. Then text. Enter text. Okay. Then specify this point. Yes. This is the vertex point. Clear. This one is V. This one is focus. See. after focus after focus you have to take okay so phi sorry after vertex after vertex please take phi equal number of parts phi equal number of parts okay so each part contains 10 mm 10 mm so that is the constant 10 mm okay by using offset command see here from vertex point mark 1 2 3 4 5 okay five points enough 
now the distance is 10 mm okay then mark this is the first point then this is the second one then third one fourth one then fifth one five points enough okay next okay so this is the 50 next please change the color of the vertex line yes so this is the sorry focus line okay next see so please give the numbers then this is the point one text single line text please choose single line text then this is the one this one is two uh, this point is three red color line is focus line this point is four five points and a five okay then but how to draw the arcs okay so in this method parabola please take c1 radius and c2 radius and c3 radius c4 radius and c5 radius f as a center and draw the arcs okay see the procedure before going to draw the circles that means ox please measure c21 radius sorry c21 distance 35 35 35 okay next 35 next choose circle f as a center this is the f f red color line is f now i am taking 35 35 okay so please mark the points so this is the first line first line okay then clear erase this one erase this one similarly similarly measure a distance from c2 to c2 to 45 then take center radius center radius f as a center 45 is the radius of circle circle mark the points mark the points okay mark the points on second line on second line okay next measure the distance from c to 3 okay 55 choose circle sorry center radius f as a center okay please type 55 okay so after that after that mark the points on third line both sides there is this one next measure the distance from c to 4 so this in this is the 65 choose center radius f as a center then 65 okay next mark the points by using multiple points see here this is the fourth line this one is a fourth line mark like this erase this one okay so similar way uh, you need to uh, draw so this point also now I am taking four points four points only now I am taking four points only then see here but how to join all these cutting points by using by using spline curve so we can join all these points by using spline okay so please enter spline okay see join like this and see okay so this is the this is the parabola curve see this is the parabola curve I removed okay 
okay so this one is the parabola curve okay so please take this is the point 1 point 2 point 3 and point 4 okay now I am taking point 1 point 2 sorry P2 single line 4 enter okay so this is the point 1 point 2 point 3 this one is point 4 okay so point 1 point 2 point 3 then point 4 so this is the parabola okay so what is the difference between parabola and hyperbola in parabola processor uh, I take in C1 radius C1 radius F as a center and draw the arc in hyperbola and ellipse I take in 1 1 dash radius F as a center okay but in this case okay you need to take C1 radius C2 radius C3 radius C4 radius F as a center for all points okay so then this is the this is the parabola okay then from here to here directrix to uh, focus is 50 C 50 uh, the next distance from this line to this line is 25 see here okay then so tangent and normal line okay same uh, for all these three curves that means hyper uh, hyperbola and parabola helix okay so please follow the same procedure for parabola also